Hello everyone, welcome back to the Access Press Pro video tutorial regarding the widgets. So today in this video tutorial, I'm going to show you some of the widgets that you can use uh, to uh, show your website in certain different way. So in our previous video, we have shown you most of the widgets explanation and the demonstration. Well, in this video, I'm going to show you about some of the widgets that is the media embedded. Then... Um, Categories, pages, recent posts, and recent comments, and uh, such widgets. So let's start with media embedded. So with this, you can display a media that is a video or a slideshow, uh, which will include the video from your YouTube, Vimeo, Flickr, etc. So you need to click it and drop it to any area. Well, I'm going to select the right sidebar. And you need to enter your title. Must watch and uh, enter your video URL. Now enter the embedded width in pixel. That is, I'm going to write 100. And uh, add your description here and save it. Now let's go to the front end of the website to see how it looks in our right sidebar. Well, to see it, as I have selected the right sidebar, you need to go to a certain page where you have selected the right sidebar layout. So I'm selecting page one. So here you can find this widget, media embedded widget, which from where you can see, uh, you can uh, show some videos to your website viewers. So in this way, this is about the media embedded. So the next widget I'm going to show you is category. So this will show a list or a drop down of the categories, total categories that you have in your uh, website. Let's select uh, area. Okay, we already Let's select this area that is footer area column 4, add widgets. Then here, you can write your category uh, title, category, and select display as drop down, show post counts, hierarchy, and then save it. Now let's again go to the front end of the website. And now this time let's go to the home page. Now this is the footer area column 4 area where you can see your categories and select one to view. Like I'm going to select this one. And here you can the full content of the category now in this way you can use this pages widget and along this recent post now let's select this pages widget and let's put it in the right sidebar along with this because both the process are same so I'm going to show you at same time here in the pages enter the title and select the page uh, select the sort by option that is a page title page order or page ID I'm gonna select page title and you can exclude the pages ID separately by commas and so on and then save it and same goes for a recent post let us enter the title then enter the number of posts to show and you can display the post date also and save it now let's go back to the front end of the website and let's see how it is looking on the right sidebar so this is the total number of pages you have on your website and this is the total number of posts you have, which when select one, you, that will take it to the full content. 
So in this way, you can use your pages and recent post widgets. So along with this, you can use this search widget to yes, uh, put it Okay, let's put it in the right sidebar. Then, oh uh, no, let's put it on the footer area column three. And simply click on add widget. Then in the footer area column three, you will have the search, enter here. Search anything from here you can write any title name and save it now after you have saved it let's go to the front end of the website and see how it looks there now let's go to the home page as we have selected the area just on the footer now here you can have your search button so I placed it here just to show how it is used. You can place it anywhere in the widget areas that we have provided. So in this way, you can use this, these widgets that is the embedded media, the pages widget, category widget, post widget, and the search widget. Thank you very much for watching this video. I hope this video is helpful to you. Take care.